Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Thursday. Thursday of our mascara thon week. And here we are. And what I'm doing right now is I'm just putting blue eyeliner on. Love the blue eyeliner. Um, and as you see, in how I am, I'm not, I don't put my mascara on in a perfect line. I just go in there, right? And go between my lashes. Okay, so there we go. Hey, Misty. How are you, hon? So there we go. Mascara. Yeah, mascara. Eyeliner is long. Love the blue. Remember, again, I go between the lashes. If you notice, I didn't do any underneath. Maybe I will. Um, but I go between the lashes. It gives more depth to your lashes. Because we're talking about mascara. Mascara. And how to do your lashes. So, what I want to talk to you today is about minking your lashes. Okay, so like for me, you know, I love the intensity. And the reason for that is I have fine, thin lashes. For you guys that have more of, of a nice lash, you know, whether it's a medium fullness, fullness, something like that, minking is for you, okay? And especially um, if you wanna just get it to look so luxurious, okay? That's what minking is. It makes your lashes luxurious. Now, what that is, sorry, I have to separate and then I get yellow so you can see I need to get my bangs cut. Now, Ultimate Mascara. It used to look like this, but now it's in a new tube and it looks like this. It's okay, it's still Ultimate Mascara, okay? Okay. Now, Ultimate Mascara comes in two colors. Actually, it comes in black, brown, and black. Now, I tell everyone, we should all wear black mascara. Unless you are the fairest of fair, and I mean super, super ivory, you know, very, very light ivory, and possibly blonde hair, blue eyes, you know, then a black brown is for you. Otherwise, this is what I love about black brown. And the reason they made a black brown is again, it's the minking idea. So what minking is, is if you've ever seen, well, they don't do it anymore, mink coats. But if you ever seen a mink or go ahead, Google mink, you will notice that their fur, and that's why they were so popular and everybody wanted them, are so luxurious. The reason for that is their hair is black and brown mixed. And you see brown, okay, brown creates depth and width. And the black creates length. So their hair looks so full, so beautiful, so thick, and so luxurious. And that's what we're going to do with our lashes. So what we're doing is we're starting with the black-brown, okay? Again, black-brown, a little bit more luxurious. I use it mainly as my depth to give my lashes more depth, more width. And I guess width the same as broad, okay? Same way. So... Here we go. You're going to notice the wand of the Ultimate Mascara is kind of like a barrel shape, kind of wide in the middle. And again, Mary Kay has, hear that pop? A Smart Wipe. That's what they have. It's called the Smart Wipe. So it gives you just the amount of mascara you need on your wand. Okay. Now, another thing you never do is you never go, I even hate to do it, pump. You never pop your mascara. Ever, ever, ever. It introduces air, which dries it out. You have to change it sooner. Oh, my goodness. No, 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 no. Never pump the mascara. So, you just pop it right out. And now, what I'm doing is this is the brown black. And I've already used my eyelash curler. And I'm just back and forth. Back and forth. Back and forth. Okay. All right, again, in, pop, other side, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. What I want to do is first get this brown black in there to create some depth. I'm going to put a second coat of the brown black. Remember, just like I told you yesterday, mascara is like spices. Yeah, uh-huh. It is, okay. 
brown, black, brown, black. Again, we're creating the depth right now and width for a luxurious lash. So as you guys know, I have fine and thin lashes, so this process doesn't, I can't get as much out of, okay, as those of you that have more fuller lashes. And I don't mean super full, medium's fine, okay? I have none, hardly. Um, so you're not going to see as much depth. Now, the brown black is on. Okay. Now, we are using the black. Again, listen. Spart wipe system. Notice the barrel. This is a brand new one. I just got it off my shelf. So I am now putting up over top. If you hear the cat in the background, it's because the dog's walking around going bugging at the cat. <laughs> okay. By the way, see the beams up there? Okay. What we're going to do, they're brown right now. What we're going to do is Mike is going to make him a gorgeous, luxurious, luxurious is my word for today, uh, deep gray. It's going to look so pretty. I can't wait. I can't wait. And then he's going to frame around the closet with white. So it's going to look really good. I love it. Keeps him busy, too. Okay, here we go. This is my... Now, remember, this is my third coat of mascara. And this is the black on top of the black brown to give us more of what we call a luxurious pop. Okay, coat number four. Four is so important. Three, you get spider. Four is the tip, okay? So, hmm, yeah, I love how these look. I'm gonna fan them out a little bit more this way. Now, what I'm doing is fanning them out a little bit this way. Getting in there. Kind of like getting the tips done here. Done some tips. No, oh, is it hard? To, like this is why it's my scary because I'm so close. Can you see? Again, my eyes. No, no, if I get up in there. My lashes are fine and thin, but can you already see the difference that minking has made? to my lashes compared to before, right? I know, it's so much fun. So, Ultimate Mascara, black, brown, and black. Two coats, black, brown on each side. Two coats or more of black on top. Again, it's minking. So, brown, black creates depth and width. The black creates length. And it makes it more shimmery. Black is more shiny versus brown is more color that takes in, um, takes in the light to make it brighter, broader. Where in black bounces the color, bounces the light away, which makes it longer and lighter. So there you go. We have some minking going on today. So I hope you guys have a fabulous Thursday, and uh, I will catch up with you tomorrow. By the way, if you have any questions about lashes please pop them in here. Love to hear your comments below. Have you ever heard of minking before? And have you ever done it before? And do you have any tips? I'd love to know. Have a great day. Bye.